if you are a cutting tool manufacturer trying to diversify into aerospace industry then in this video i have tried to identify three key trends that i am seeing in my research now while researching this topic of how cutting tool manufacturers can take advantage of the explosive growth that is seen or expected in the aerospace industry i identified or came across three main major themes or three key trends in this industry the first trend that i observed was that the quality or the surface finish of the component is very important for mainly for the component manufacturers now while achieving this high quality surface finishes the component manufacturers they don't want to increase the time spent by the component in the machine tool so they are looking for ways to constantly reduce the machining time like any other industry even this industry too they are trying they understand that time is the most important factor so reducing machining time by various ways of let's say using faster machines or using multi purpose tools so basically they want to eliminate steps or they want to eliminate uh, unnecessary non value added operations because everybody understands that time is the highest cost in any machining this is what i learned and this can have the most significant economic repercussions so to sum up the key trend that i am seeing in this sector is that the roughing and the finishing operations they want to do in in the same machine tool or with the same cutting tool the second key trend that i am seeing is that there is no one particular component so as you can imagine an aircraft will have obviously the engine the air frames the hydraulics the electronics the landing gear there are so many parts that go in an aircraft or even the drones so the component manufacturers they tend to have diverse demands and challenges and requirements for each of these products or each of these components so they expect their suppliers that is the cutting tool manufacturers they should have strategies or products for each and every individual problem of theirs so it is not a one stop solution it is not that if you supply one particular tool to a one particular component manufacturer you can use the same or the same method can be used for the other component manufacturer just because the components that they may be making will be diverse will be different third key trend that i observed is that companies in in this aerospace industry they have very specific demands from their suppliers some of the key demands that they have is that high productivity very high quality excellent repeatability and traceability the whole idea behind this is to reduce their cost per meter that is again it ties to the time consumed or reducing time so the auxiliary of that is to reduce the cost per meter while cutting i hope this video was helpful for you please share your experience your interesting stories if you have them or your opinion regarding the aerospace industry in the comments below thank you